All right, some more uh, Patreon requests, and this one comes from Hunter Johnson, who asked me to do a story called The Last Stand of Optimus Prime. As always, if you guys would like to have a Patreon request done, just hit the link below, head on over to my Patreon, where you guys can hit the third tier. That'll allow you access to do so. But other than that, hope you all enjoy this, and let's get started with the video. So the story basically is... so. This story is kind of ending, uh, starting on a on a pretty sour note. It's a, it's starting off on a pretty bad note. Essentially, what has happened is that all the villains have united as one big army. They have all like united under one banner and are now going on like an old man Logan all villains slaughter uh, slaughter fest. There are heroes being killed left and right, um, and it's gotten ex it's gotten bad. It's <laughs> it's uh it's like go it's like it's bad. Go get dad. <laughs> um, we've gotten to that level of uh, shit. It, it, shit has gone sideways. The G, uh, the G, most of the Joes have been wiped out. Uh, some of the sa a lot of the Sailor Guardians have been killed off. Others have gone missing. Um, the uh, it's been confirmed. Dan uh, Danny Phantom has been killed. No one knows where the Powerpuff Girls are. Um, they don't know what happened to, uh, like, there's just heroes dead, like, dead and or missing left and right. That's what's going on, and shit is not, you know, shit has gotten worse and worse. And they know it's, a, like, over at the Ark, the, um, at the home base of the Autobots, what has happened is that, um, what has happened? is that they're gearing up because they know they're next. Like, they are fully aware about what's about to happen. They are uh, very much aware that what's about to happen next is not going to go good for, uh, for them. They are, uh, like, they know they're on the, uh, they're, uh, they are another threat to the villain army, and it's only a matter of time before the Decepticons, who they know are a part of this whole massacre, are, um, a part, of, uh, like, they, they know they're going to come calling. So it's now like the Autobots are gearing up defenses. They're gearing up. Um, they're gearing up for one for one final stand, or at the very least, turn the tide and hold them off. Also, try like after this, they can try to like find the other lost or he lost heroes or those dying in the field. Um, but however, when the, uh, like the problem is, is that Optimus was talking to Teletran two earlier, and he's already made the assumption that like we're not going to win this. Like, there is no way that we are going to win this battle. There's just, it, like, I've run, like, the a simulation on Teletran, um, a hun like, hundreds of times. There's just no fucking way we are going to win this battle. So, I need, uh, like, uh, the Autobots need to live. Like, no matter what, the Autobots need to live. So, I am going to send them away. I am going to, um, order them to go into hiding, you know. And Optimus will stand alone um, before these enemies, you know, before the army of villains alone and try to di divert them. And Bumblebee and the other Autobots are like, no, that's impossible. You will die. Don't you understand? You will, uh, like, they're going to kill you. Um, but Optimus is like, I can't let all of you die. I I if it's just me, then, you know, they'll, c th like, if I'm not here, they'll, ki they like, it won't matter. Like if, like, if I'm the only one going into hiding, like, even some of the Autobots are like, no, 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 I'll go, you go, Prime. Like, you stay, you know, you go into hiding. I'll stay behind. Me too, yeah. But, Opt uh, but Optimus is like, no, this is not what we're doing. If I'm not here, they will kill all of you. And if, if it's just me, if it's, if it's just me, that'll satis- I think that'll just satisfy them, and they won't care. Like, Megatron- is go like Megatron will probably like talk them out, and the other villains will probably like talk them out, uh, like talk them out of hunting the Autobots. They'll call it a victory if they just kill me, but you guys will be alive. You'll be able to reconnect with the other lost heroes and be able to start a resistance movement. But in order to do that, it needs to be me. So, uh, Optimus is like we're not discussing this anymore. As my final order of the Autobot army. Of the Autobot, um, of the Autobots, as the last leader, as your prime and as your leader, this is my final order. You are to retreat, and I will stay behind and stand, you know, and stand against this horde. So that's what regrettably happens. 
is that the um, the Autobots, uh, the remaining Autobots, trans all transform and they flee through secret uh, passages and whatnot, leaving only Optimus alone at Teletran One with all of its defenses. Like when the uh, when the sun starts to set, that's when like Optimus sees like a big plume of of uh, sand just kind of coming his way, and he's like, "All right, here we go." Like this is it. like now we're on. And it's sure enough, it's Megatron, the Decepticons, you've got Black Hat, you've got Powerpuff Girls villains, you've got Danny's villains, you've got, you know, all, like, even Jasper went, it, like, switched from Steven Universe, she switched sides during the massacre. Like, she went back to being a villain and just, like, turned, like, pulled a Hulk in from Old Man Logan and just helped kill the other Crystal Gems. Um, so they're all there. And they're just, like, they're seeing... Like the uh, seeing Teletran one and Megatron's all like, "Oh, I've been waiting for an eternity for this," so they call out like to the uh, like they even do a scan real quick and it's like, "Hey, the Autobot, uh, there's only one li a Cybertronian life sign in there," and, and Megatron already knows it's Prime. He uh, that sanctimonious fucktard had to, uh, like just had to make it about him. All right, if he wants to have a glorious death, let's uh, let's give him. I say we give him that. So they call out to him like, "Hey." Optimus, if you come out with your, you know, if you surrender to us, we'll make it quick and painless. That's a lie. We're going to make it worse. And that's Optimus's reply is just saying, Teletran 1, fire everything. And the defense system goes online. It starts, like, just unleashing, you know, volleys of, of uh, you know, blasts and, and rockets, lasers, everything. Some of the villains get caught in it. Others have to, like, dodge it and whatnot. Even Optimus activates, like, uh, several mines that were planted. Um, it's just disorienting left and right. It is just one big chaotic... Um, it's just one big chaotic moment after another. And there's really no stopping it, no matter what. Um, the villains keep fighting their way through it. Black Hat himself just goes full demon and starts slaying his way through it. And once they start tearing their way into... Um, Teletran 1, Optimus is there with like gut, like all kinds of weapons he's taken from the armory, and he's just like, you know, <laughs> roll out, and just fire, and starts firing into the villains. Megatron tears through the, uh, through the, um, uh, wet, through the volley of fire and starts attacking Optimus. They have their big fight. All the other villains are like jumping in. Optimus is like just fighting you know, fighting with everything he has in this moment, because he knows the longer he draws them out, the more time the Autobots have to, uh, have to flee. So it's just one big bloody mess after, and it's just, Energon is pouring out of him, systems are failing, he is, Optimus is dying. Like, by the end of it, he is torn to pieces by, uh, by just swarms of, vil by swaths of villains, he's down on the ground, just, you know, on the ground dying. And uh, Megatron, who also took some licks in, Megatron just, like, pulls open Optimus's chest to grab the Matrix of Leadership, and it's gone. The Matrix was given to... Um, the Matrix was given um, to Hyde by um, Alita One. Alita One is now the new... Pr Alita Prime, as she's now being called. Um, she's now the leader of the Autobots, the underground Autobot resistance movement. And Megatron is just like... You son of... It, like, you, of course, you had to steal it from me at the last second. He's like, it wouldn't be... A, you know, the Autobots will live, and your little re your little villain army will it will be in it at an end. And he's like, but she, maybe. But you won't live enough to uh, live long enough to see it, Prime. And just blows his head off. But the Autobots are safe. The uh, villains continue their massacre of the, vi of, the ar of the villain... The villain massacre continues of the heroes... But the auto the Autobots that manage to get away are now like building a little resistance. They find out Steven survived. They find out F Sailor Mercury survived. Um, they find out that um, Kim Possible also survived her attack. Um, so the resistance movement starts to build from there. So there you go, guys. That is the last stand of Optimus Prime. I'd like to thank Hunter Johnson for this Patreon request, as well as continued patronage. You guys tell me in the comments below what you guys think of it. Comment below, let me know. I really don't want to, like, I know this sounds like the start of an Old Man Logan story. I really don't want to do any more Old Man story, Old Man Logan or Old Man Lady stories. I feel like we've played that out, so I really don't want to do a sequel to this. I just thought it'd be kind of a cool story. But anyway, you guys just comment below, let me know what you guys thought of this. Other than that, hope you all enjoyed this. I'm Mr. Multiverse. I'll see you next time in the Multiverse.